If you guys are looking to buy or sell your Rocket League items for money, then make sure to head to the first link in the description. You can buy absolutely any item that you want and have now also included item bundles to save you guys even more money and save more from your purchase with code jakers at checkout it's giveaway time and if you guys want to win party time or popcorn the two new mystery goal explosions then make sure to drop a like on today's video subscribe to the channel turn on post notifications and leave a comment with your details down below and also what's your favorite new item from this new crate hey what's going on guys i am jakers and welcome back to another rocket league video on the channel and today we're going to be building the most expensive accelerator car and I'm really excited because I think sometime next week we might be seeing the return of a seasonal crate so we actually haven't had this at all yet and we're going to get a brand new Halloween crate and I've seen it it looks so awesome I might make a video on it soon to cover what I feel like are going to be the items in this new Halloween crate but soon I'm going to be selling all of my items so this is the last video I'm going to be making with all of the items I'm going to be showing you guys in today's video so yeah this is the last time you're going to see them it's all of the accelerator items to build an awesome and most expensive car before I feel like those items will go less popular and go down in value maybe and then when the Halloween crate comes out I think you can only buy the crates outright on the store so I'm going to be buying a load of those um, yeah, it's just open up quite soon. Hopefully, it's Friday the 13th, the day I'm recording this video, so it might drop tonight, I don't know. Um, usually, it drops on Wednesday, so it might be next Wednesday, but I'll definitely have a video on that, so make sure to stay tuned on the channel for that. But yeah, today's video is the most expensive accelerator car, and I've been grinding to get all of these items. So just before I click this customized car button, let's jump into, I feel like it's seven different trades for loads of the most expensive new accelerator crate items. So here are the trades that I did for those individual items okay guys so here is the first trade that i did to buy the first item that we needed to build this most expensive new car which is for the titanium white clockwork wheels i paid black dracos and 50 keys which may seem like a huge overpay but at the time these wheels were worth about 70 to 80 keys and are now dropped to about i think 40 to 50 keys so it was a huge overpay at the time so i paid about 60 for the clockworks and i now paid about 65 to 70 for the chronos the titanium white chronos which in my opinion are a little bit better and you guys will see a showcase of these wheels very soon when I get to showing off these awesome new wheels on the car. Next into the next trade we've got the titanium white power shot which in my opinion is the best boost that you can get on Rocket League right now better than the Helios which is a RCS reward. I paid 12 keys for this boost and it's still worth 12 keys so I feel like it's still a good investment even though I bought it when it's first dropped. The fourth item that we're going to move on to the trade that I did for was a titanium white halo. I paid 19 keys for this topper and I feel like I can easily get offers of around 25 keys for it and it's slowly getting more popular as days go by and I've seen a lot of people offering for painted halos so I feel like I can easily sell it even if I did want to sell it on but I probably won't because it's an awesome looking new topper that you can get. We're down to the last two items that we needed to collect and this is the second from last which is the party time goal explosion. I paid 30 keys for this item and it's still worth 30 keys. So I feel like I did a good job at pricing this item before it was on the price list and had first come out with the accelerator crate. Finally, we're moving on to the last trade. I was actually going to buy a Heatwave and a 20XX from this guy to show you guys in the showcase um, what the Heatwave and the, also the 20XX would look like on the car. But instead, I just bought 20XX because he was only selling that. And so I paid 20 keys. It's actually worth just 20 keys and not 19 to 20 anymore. So I feel like this is a stable item since it doesn't have a region of value. So yeah, but like it's a good. Okay, so without wasting any more time, it's time to click customized car and as you're seeing right now I've got the 99 Nissan Skyline GTR R34. It's an awesome new car but we're not going to be looking at that car today unfortunately even though it does look really sick. Um, yeah I do recommend buying that over the Dodge Charger. We actually me and Jojo recorded a freestyling video of that car so yeah that might be out soon as well. Um, I'm just literally spoiling all of them but we're looking for right now if we go to J the Jaeger uh, 619 RS titanium white this car right now is about 35 to 40 keys I paid around that same price, but I paid it as soon as it came out This is about a week after the crates dropped We're going for 20 XX in today's video because this is worth 20 keys on ps4 and is the most expensive Black market on the game right now. Um, we've got Taurus I would have bought heatwave because I actually personally like heatwave better than the 20 XX, but yeah 
We'll go for that today, um, and then we'll leave the customization of the colors until later, but the, of course the accelerator crate holds two of the exotics, which are the chronos and the clockworks. We've got both of those and crimson in the clockworks as well. We've got a few different colors that we actually managed to get from Pick a Pixel in the blind training video, such as pink, we've got two pairs of those now, but titanium white, which I don't decide yet which team we're gonna have those on, we'll just do it randomly. Um, you guys can decide in the comments which one of these is your favourite out of the chronos and the clockworks. We had sort of a battle going on in the buying all of the white wheels video that I made. But yeah, we could use crimson. Those are quite expensive. They're about five keys under the titanium white. But yeah, so they're not the most expensive. So we're not going to use those today. But of course, the power shot is the most expensive boost from the new accelerator crate. We've got the crimson as well, which is awesome. Um, yeah, it would go over red car if I was to make a red car on the orange team. But yeah, for that, now we're just going to leave that. The Technically, we're going to call this the accelerator update car um, because some of these items aren't necessarily in the crate. But we've got the titanium white halo, which is awesome. Uh, we've got a really good deal for that, in my opinion. 20, around 20 keys, I think I paid, maybe 19. Um, and Peter, loads of people were asking for about 30 the day it drops. I don't really like antennas, so for now, I'm just going to leave that blank. We could have used the beta market, and on PC, it's very popular. Skillful Striker Lightning, wow. <clears throat> okay, we are back. A big problem of why I couldn't make videos recently, and I haven't been uploading as much, is because PS4 Rocket League is just broken, and it glitches every time I load it up, and I literally have to restart about five times to make one video, so yeah, that's pretty annoying, and yeah, hopefully they fix it soon, but... I'll have to work around that, I guess. Antenna, of course. We moved straight on to the uh, Skillful Striker Lightning, which I got in a trade up quite recently. I would use the normal Lightning, but I feel like Striker just makes it a little bit better. And one extra thing in today's video, we're not going to be using the Certified Striker, even though we are for the, the Lightning Trail, all of the other ones. Um, aesthetically, they're not different. I'm just trying to show off the item or, uh, of the actual, not rather than the value. Even though we do the trades for the items, I just want to show the base sort of. Um, thing. So yeah, let's look for the, the car that we just bought recently. What's it called? The 99. I think it's right at the bottom. Okay, maybe not. Um, yeah, I want to use that sort of car engine sound because that sounds really, really cool. Um, when I bought that car, I was just so excited to use that car color. Maybe maybe we'll just use the, the Jaeger sort of feel. Um, and then of course, party time is our gold explosion, of course. Um, so yeah, we're not going to be using the search striker in today's video for that. We can mess around with the colors now before we get into a game. So I like purple, of course, you can tell by my channel colors, um, if I'm new to the channel. Uh, whew. I think we'll go with that, and then we'll go with red on this, because I think red is the best color that you can probably get on this. Okay, please, Ooh. oh, okay, maybe a darker purple and then a lighter purple. Oh, I like that, I like that, that looks pretty cool. Yeah, we're gonna jump into some games with this. We could um, have done that with the, the other car up here, the Nissan, uh, that looks pretty cool. Not so nice, I feel like Heatwave looks better with that and I could have used Heatwave with this car, but yeah. 20XX is the most expensive, so we're using that in today's video. Um, yeah, so let's take this into a game, see what it's like, see what it feels like, see what it looks like. Um, and yeah, I'll cut some gameplay very soon, so let's do that right now. Okay, I decided to jump into a game of ones because I feel like when I play 2v2s, I play better um, like with a partner. And I don't have a partner in today's video, so we're going to be playing ones. Um, yeah, like this is ranked as well. I feel like I'm I feel like I'm gold in ones I'm not too sure, but I'm not too great at the game I'm just here to show off the car So let's while we're playing show off each individual aspect of the car and then when the new Halloween crate Hopefully the Halloween crate has some really awesome items. Maybe it, I don't know what they'll do with it Like it's just hard to know what they're going to bring with that uh, crate I'm gonna leave my sort of opinions until that video that I'm gonna make quite soon. Oh, I tried to expect um, him to hit that up. But yeah, I, I will leave that until the video. I, I know exactly what I feel like they're going to bring, um, especially with like the decals and stuff like that. Hopefully there will be more mysteries. That's all I'm going to say. That's all I'm going to spoil before I make that one video on the Halloween crate. But yeah, if you haven't seen it already, um, I'll probably get a picture and put it up on the screen right now for you guys uh, to show you what it looks like before I make that video. But yeah, um, apparently there's going to be four new goal explosions with it. Yeah, if you want to know why, then watch Lama Says video, I think uh, he covers that. But yeah, four new gold explosions. We'll talk about each individual item on this car right now. Um, I, I would have played with the... Oh, gee, oh, that was close. I would have played with the Crimson uh, Power Shot. I actually do like the way it looks. But yeah, that would have gone nice with like a Crimson Halo, which I don't have at the moment. But yeah, I would have loved to buy these set of Halos. But I feel like soon they won't be 20 keys anymore because, you know, like with the other toppers... Um, went down in value. I'm probably not going to try too hard this game because I want to show off the car at the same time. So yeah, let's do that 
Okay, that was very close. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't usually talk, when I have gameplay, I usually I'm just talking over it like this, but yeah, um, it feels weird to be going back into that sort of way of like, me playing ones, but yeah. Um, the Chrono Wheels are my favourite wheel in the game right now. Um, I, I just like the way that they're kind of thick. The clockworks were my favourite from this new crate. I don't know what I'm doing there. That's just not way to land. Um, yeah, so uh, the clockworks were fantastic wheels when I first saw them. But nowadays, I just feel like they're a bit too thin and they don't really shine as much as what I'd like them to. Um, I'm going to finish this, hopefully. Yep, okay, top corner, bang. <laughs> Party time, that looks fantastic. Um, the bottom of this car, I'm really pleased with how it turns out, but like the sides, when you're playing on grass like that, it's sort of, it, the, the, the Jaeger, I pronounced it right this time, um, it goes so low down, like the suspension and stuff like that. I, I don't know what I'm talking about, I know nothing about cars, so I don't know why I keep rambling on about that. Yeah, but yeah, um, it just goes so close down to the ground that it just makes the car a lot lower than what it usually is, like compared to like a Dominus or something. So you don't really get to see that sort of white unless you're going up for an aerial like that. Um, you don't really get to see the white. So um, I feel like that's a bit of a downfall. Um, the new cars, I love the skyline. You guys will see a lot of gameplay soon. Um, I'm not going to spoil the video that me and Jojo did. I feel like I already did at the start of the video, but yeah, I, I don't know. But yeah, literally, literally this white halo topper, um, 19 keys. Is it worth it? I don't know. It's a bit expensive for a topper. Like, it is the most expensive topper out there. I've seen those really cool Rhino ears. Those look really sick. I saw a camp from Russia made a video on those. Um, yeah, that was actually the first time. I think it's called like Stegosaurus. That looks. Oh, I tried to flick it over them. Um, but yeah, um, that looks really sick. I, I would have used those. I don't know how much those are. I don't think they're the most expensive. I think the Halo is still the most expensive. But yeah, we've got 20XX. In my opinion, it shouldn't be the most expensive mystery. I feel like Heatwave has been out for longer. That's why it's less expensive, because Heatwave's been in many crates um, as like a secondary uh, decal, but that was such a nice flick. Um, yeah, I'm really bad. Don't don't judge. Okay, winner by forfeit. Maybe we'll play another game. I don't know. Thank you guys all for watching. It's been an awesome time taking a look at this new car. And although we sort of broke the rules at the end there, um, yeah, it's been an awesome time. Make sure to drop a like if you enjoyed today's video. And I'll catch all of you guys in the next one. So peace out until next time.